welcome to another episode of Josh Plays with Himself. What's going on today, guys? Josh here, back with another toy review for the channel. Today, we got the NECA 4-pack Punk Disguise Turtles. These were a pain in the ass to find. Thankfully, when I was up north at work, I was able to sneak off to a target and I was able to find them. So let's see what we're working with here. You got Darnell, you got Rocco, Lotharius, and Montgomery. You got the four turtles in the bottom right here. Let's turn this thing around and see what's on the back. You got a nice view of all four turtles. You got the boombox, you got his skateboard, you got him doing a trick with the skateboard. You got the four alternate heads right here in the bottom. You got them carrying groceries right here. And these are the other figures in the line. If I get any of them, it might be the two-pack. Then I'll customize these into Raph, and that's about it. So let's get this bad boy open and see what they're about. Now let's start with the accessories. You get the four alternate heads right there. You get the two bags of groceries. You get a skateboard, a boombox, a pizza, a little ray gun, and I can't remember the little robot's name. If you know what it is, let me know in the comments. Then you get two additional hands per turtle, which if you can see... Which are pretty much mix and match, so they'll go with any turtle you want. Now let's check out the articulation. Now let's start with Donnie here. You don't really look up that much, but that's okay. Looks down about that much. There's no swivel in the... There's no ab crunch right there, so... You can bend about that much with the elbow. It is double jointed, but you don't get too much movement because of the jacket. You can do a full 360 with the wrist, and you can't really bend his hand because of the jacket again. So, his legs, double jointed. You can bend his knees about that much. You can kick up about that much. He can go back about that much. He's got a little bit of a swivel right here on his hip. Now, you don't get much of a swivel. Actually, you do. It was a little stiff before. So you get a little bit of a swivel on the ankle. You can go down about that much. And back into place, pretty much. You can't really go up. These are a little stiff. So if you're going to pose them, which I'm assuming you are, you might want to hit it with a hairdryer first before you break something. Because I feel like I might break them. Which neck is always that way, in my opinion. NECA always, you got to hit him with warm water or or a, a hair dryer. Because they're always very stiff. So now let's check out some poses. Here you got Donnie with his little blaster looking real cool. The detail on these are always great. NECA always knocks it out of the park. Especially the cartoon versions. They're amazing. You got him with the groceries. You got two different things of groceries. I'll show you the other one on one of the other turtles. I can't for the life of me remember the robot's name. One of you guys tell me what it is in the comments. Then you got Donnie with his little mohawk. And remember what I was saying earlier about being stiff. He's very, very stiff. So definitely take a hairdryer or run him under some warm water. But here you got Raph. Looking real cool. Then you got Raph right here with a skateboard. I don't know if I want to put him with the skateboard or Mikey. Probably Mikey. But Raph or Mikey would look great with the skateboard. Then you got Raph here with the boombox. And then you got Raph and his little red mohawk. Then you got Leo in his black leather jacket, which I think the black looks the best. I definitely think I might customize him into Raph, only because I like the black better. I might swap top bodies if I can. And you got Leo with the other bag of groceries. Then you got Leo with his red mohawk, which I think they should have probably made it blue. But maybe blue would have been too much. They all look good. They really do. And I like Leo's face better than Raph's, actually. 
I think that pose is more raff than anything. That facial expression, I mean. We'll see. And then you got, last but not least, Mikey. Mikey looks good, too. Again, they all look good, in my opinion. But they are very stiff. And NECA always has a problem with that. And you got Mikey and his skateboard. Let me move him back a little bit. I think I might have to put it, the skateboard with Mikey, right? It just makes more sense. Then you got Mikey attempting a kickflip. Or heel flip, I think, rather. Whatever, it looks cool. And then you got Mikey looking real stoned with his disguise on. With his flat top mohawk. These look great. But they're very, very hard to pose. This took me 10 minutes to get these things up. And they're probably going to fall. And I'm not editing it out. So overall, I think these turtles are really, really good. NECA always knocks it out of the park with the detail on everything they do. But their feet are horrible. They, they don't stand right. You, you always need additional stands and everything to get them to stand properly. But I'm probably just going to... I don't really know what I'm going to do with these. Throw them up on the shelf. Pull them a few different ways and see which ones I like better. Probably get some of the stands that hold them from the waist. Put Mikey on uh, his skateboard like I did before. But overall, I think these are really, really good turtles. But this is the pose that you're going to get out of me. It took me 10 minutes to put this up. And they're probably going to fall as soon as I turn the video off. I did, however, learn that you can mix and match these. So remember before, like I was saying... I wanted Raph with Leo's face on it. Looks like you can do that. That I do like. Let me see if I can pop this back on. For Leo. Some of them don't pop on properly. And it took me a minute to even get them off. There you go. So they do have swappable faces and everything. Which is really, really cool. So hopefully, I can swap the jackets. To make Rev have the black one. Now with that being said. You can. Tell me Rev doesn't look great. With the black leather jacket on. It looks great. Thanks again for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.